Let us simplify the expression square root of root 9 minus root 8. Root 9 can be written as 3. Root 8, we can factorize 8 as 2 into 4 is 8. And 4 can be written as 2 into 2. So 8 equal to 2 square into 2. So root 8 equal to root over 2 square into 2. And that's equal to 2 root 2. So root 8 equal to 2 root 2. Well, is it the simplification? Yes, but not the final expression. We can simplify it further. Let's see how. 3 can be written as 2 plus 1. Let me write 1 this side. Minus 2 root 2 as it is. And 2 can be written as root 2 whole square. Minus 2 root 2 into 1 plus 1 can be written as 1 square. Observe that this is expression a square minus 2ab plus b square. So that can simply be written as a minus b whole thing square. Root 2 minus 1 whole thing square. And that's exactly equal to root 2 minus 1. Okay, that's the simple equation and that's the final answer. Suppose someone does a slightly different method. 3 can be written as 2 plus 1 or someone writes say 1 plus 2. So 1 square minus 2 root 2 plus 2. Is he correct? Yes. Then he writes it as 1 square minus 2 into 1 into root 2 plus root 2 square. Yes, he is correct. Then he writes it as 1 minus root 2 whole thing square. And finally he writes it as 1 minus root 2. Is he correct? No. What's the wrong? Because square root of number, we regard it to be a positive quantity and 1 minus root 2 is not a positive quantity. So it is correct up to this point, but here we have to take minus of this and so that is equal to root 2 minus 1. 